advocate for are victims of the general view of donors, donor agencies and so forth, because they're born where they engage each other. And we take this throughout the country, and these are both recorded and broadcasted live on TV, so that others in the different parts of the, com in the country, the villages and communities can listen to it and watch and learn, and also try to develop um, advocacy groups so that they can bring their issues, such as um, the handicapped ones here, to, to the fore. Because um, these are, I mean, our problem is really lack of um, ad strong advocacy groups in, our, in, our, in the local levels, in the villages and communities and towns. So that's what, what we've been really focusing on, capacitizing these local. Hearing what you're doing, and maybe you can have some more discussions later. Now, moving on to Zambia, we have um, Mrs. Susan Nikita from the regulatory agency in Zambia. So the Republic of Zambia has been committed to the cause of uh, promoting the interests of uh, persons with disabilities across all sectors of the economy. But I'll try as much as possible to talk about uh, that in as far as it relates to ICTs. Um, the government of the Republic of Zambia has established some ministries such as uh, Community Development and Social Welfare that are directly concerned with aspects or all aspects that relate to the persons with disabilities. Um, when it comes to ICTs, the Ministry of Communications and Transport, in collaboration with the Communications Authority, which is the regulator that I work for, and uh, service providers, collaborated over a period of two years to prepare uh, the ICT policy, which was adopted last year in February. The ICT policy has got 13 pillars, and these 13 pillars hinge on the economic activities of the country, ranging from ICTs, agriculture, tourism, um, sports, and all of that. The, the, the basis of the policy is that the ICTs cut provides some assistive technologies for persons with disabilities. The authority in talking to associations of persons with disabilities is also informing the persons with disabilities that they also need to play a part, especially when it comes to education and literacy. Because the authority believes that they must take a step and then the authority will meet them halfway through all three quarters of um, So far, with the sub providers, uh, the sites where these base stations will be allocated or deployed was agreed with the service providers. Commitment has been given by the service providers. In addition to that, for ISPs, the authority is also establishing points of presence which will be uh, used on a sharing basis, agreed with uh, internet service providers. Because the authority believes that uh, IP is the technology of the future and uh, given its um, easy to deploy and uh, affordability is a technology that the authority intends to promote. Um, other than that, we have 36 